Do you know that there are two opinions about homosexuality? The first is the world, and the world says to be tolerant. The second opinion is God, and he says this, Thou shalt not lie with mankind as with womankind, it is abomination. Leviticus 18.22 Now God is holy, he created male and female. Homosexuality is rebellion to God's creation. In 2 Peter 2.6, we see God turning the cities of Sodom and Gomorrah into ashes, condemned them with an overthrow, making them an example unto those that after should live ungodly. And we also see that God delivered just Lot. Why? Because he was vexed with the filthy conversation of the wicked. For that righteous man dwelling among them, and seeing and hearing, vex his righteous soul from day to day with their unlawful deeds. So this is the word of God. God promises to destroy every homosexual society. We also see this in Jude 7, Leviticus 18:25, and also we see that God turns people over to be a reprobate, which is they reject God, they push God out of their mind. So he allows them to do what they want to do, which is this homosexual and lesbian sin. We see that in Romans 1, 24 to 32. Jesus gave us the most compassionate and loving response. He said to repent. That's why I'm calling the nation to repent of homosexual sin, because I care for people and I care for the United States of America. Will you do that? Will you agree right now that God is right and that you're going to follow the Lord? The Bible says this is urgent and it's important. Sodom and Gomorrah were totally destroyed. The people are in hell. If you love God who says that marriage is one man and one woman, I invite you to join me. Let's work together and turn the USA to God. Go to www.usa.church and become a monthly partner or make a one-time special offering to God. This is important. Lives are at stake.